What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Tex, favorite gamer that plays games, bars. No, I haven't worn the hat in a minute. I had to put it back on for old times. I used to wear this thing all the time. Still is on the store if you guys want to go to the store. TexturAnimate.com. Pick yourself up a, uh, I want to say it's a Tex, Tex 2020. Text 2020? It's text 2020. I'm gonna go by that. Dreamhack 2022, I know that happened a good bit ago, but I'm just not getting to <laughs> edit in this video. A lot of stuff is popping up left and right, but I'm, I'm trying to find a way to navigate and maneuver through it. So now here I am. Uh, Dreamhack, Dreamhack was a blast. I had the pleasure to be invited by Miss Angelic Layla. Uh, for those of y'all who don't know, I am her artist for her emotes. So if you go into her stream, I'll tag her uh, Twitch in the description down below and also on screen um, If you guys go and follow her Let her know that the homie tech sent you all of her emotes that are available I believe her free emotes and her subscriber emotes are done by yours truly and Because of that that makes me a part of her team. So she was able to get your boy and Bebe some uh, Some three-day passes to go to dreamhack and that was a blast um First thing we did when we got there, we we wore the merch, uh, made made Cafe Monet uh, hoodies, wore that, took a couple pictures. Funny enough, it was right next to a place I used to work, so I was able to get uh, I was able to get the hookup on some parking. Man, we get in there, big wall, huge wall full of plushies. Um, game consoles everywhere everybody was in or most of the people were in costumes um we did end up meeting up with the home girl layla and some friends took pictures with them hung out with them the first day uh, i think the first day we stayed from the time that they opened to almost the time that they well not that they closed they were pretty much 24 hours for the, the all day passes but uh, we stayed i think from 8 in the morning to 6 p.m so we were there for a long time um there was a monster like a bar and they were giving away free monsters and they put me on one called ozzy lemonade y'all for those of y'all that like arnold palmer's tea and lemonade together ozzy lemonade is just that with a hint of carbonation it is so good matter of fact i have four on me right now and uh we were able to just we it's unlimited i asked her i said how many are we limited to a day she was like so long as you finish the one you can keep having them i was like that sounds unhealthy but uh, say less a bunch of booths to go to i made some connections with, with some artists and just like picking their brains seeing where they got their stuff done acrylic charms stickers shirts all that stuff um so it was pretty neat took some more pictures of myself <laughs> uh posted up next to dream hack as you guys can see on screen now um they gave me a whole intro, a whole like 360 kind of. It was a green screen room and uh, I don't know how many cameras they had lined up, but they were like, hey, on the count of three, do a pose or do something that you want to do and it'll be slowed down uh, across a bunch of different cameras. And this is the pose that I chose. So <laughs> um, we ended up passing by. There was a bunch of tournaments going on. There was one for Rocket League, one for CSGO. And then eventually later on, there was one for uh, Super Smash Bros. Ultimate. Um, they had a whole fighting game community like set up over there. Street Fighter, all the all the cabinets, all the older cabinets, uh, Tekken, everything was lined up for bracket. Um, next to the food area, the food bar, they had a whole lineup. There was a whole, I don't even know if they were like all on the same team or what, but they were all playing Fortnite. I was like, dang, that looks cool. Like imagine everybody posted up playing Smash or posted up playing Halo or something. But yeah, all in all, it was just such a, a fun experience. Uh, I actually got to sit down and commentate uh, on a match, not actual sit down and commentate, but I'm just sitting there watching the match and I'll, I'll play that clip here shortly. Can Snake do it? Can he do the 2v1? all for that do play smash so i got to see fatality i almost challenged him but i was like nah he looks like he's he's busy doing his own thing and i probably get swept so 
one of the best Captain Falcons in the region. Uh, I think in, in, in general. Who knows? I wasn't trying to find out. There was a whole phase booth. I decided to pose next to the phase booth. Like, yeah, your boy got invited to phase. Um, but uh, like I said, overall, it was a fantastic experience. We went two out of the three days because we had we had family that that time too. So uh, we didn't get to stay all three days. But yeah, uh, if I ever got invited out to do something like that again, I would absolutely, absolutely. Even if it was just me, uh, take her up on that offer. So uh, Layla, if you're watching this video, <laughs> If you get invited to anything else, please shoot me an invite. But uh, DreamHack aside, I did want to talk about some stuff that I, I plan on doing in the future. So I'm getting in a bit of an artsy mood, wanting to draw and uh, just do some digital artwork. I haven't done any in, in a minute. So uh, I ran a poll on Twitter. 100% of you guys wanted me to do Waifu Collection as opposed to Near Replicant Part 6. So. With that being said, so you guys aren't sitting in, in the sidelines like, well, text, text, where's the content? What, where, where's the, where's the YouTube videos? It's gonna be on standby for just a little bit. I'll still be streaming over on twitch.tv slash iTextRL. I'll still be streaming, um, but the YouTube videos, the content creation will be on a standby. The TikToks will be on a standby. Um, I'm gonna get some art out the way. I will still be grabbing clips for TikToks, um, but they won't be as frequent. I probably won't be streaming every Friday at 6 p.m. There may be times where I do every other Friday, um, but nonetheless, when I am streaming, it will be for an extensive period of time, and it'll be across many different games. Um, so just keep keep a, keep a lookout. I do plan on doing that. A couple games that I have in mind for future Let's Plays, uh, DMC5, uh, Code Vein, I think I have another one lined up that I can't name off the top of my head, but yeah, um, alongside near replicant, just to kind of keep the rotation fresh. And there may be times where you guys see video quality like this, or you'll see video quality like this. Either way it goes, the there's gonna be a give and a take. There's gonna be a cost. If you guys wanna see frequent videos after I get done with the waifu collection, you guys are going to have to put up with video quality like this. And this isn't bad necessarily, but it's not nearly as clear as, as my other camera here. So um, just know if y'all want frequent videos, it's going to be on this. And I think that's about that about sums it up. Uh, we'll be streaming Among Us come this Friday with a couple of friends. If those friends do not get on, I do have a contingency plan. We'll be playing some Fall Guys instead. I haven't really been playing it like that. I want to see what the game is like. Uh, <laughs> get some dubs if I can get some dubs, but if not, hey, you know, all, all all in all in effort. We'll get an E for effort. I have been practicing um, more Smash, more Kazuya plays, and uh, your boy went pretty far in, in bracket last uh, last week. So we'll see if this week comes with the same results. But with that being said. Like I said, DreamHack was a hell of an experience. I hope that we get invited out to do another one of those conventions uh, sometime soon. And artwork is going to be coming out. Uh, I may do some speed paints just to kind of keep content creation at a steady flow. But if I don't, that's what I'm doing. I'm, I'm drawing. So, um, yeah, that about wraps the video up. I will see you guys on the next one. Peace.